This is gonna be a quick one. I just wanna show you this Chrome extension I came across. It lets us annotate, privately annotate on videos from several platforms like Vimeo, YouTube, and so many others. You can even annotate on videos on your Google Drive, OneDrive, the ones you have in your computer. If you check the website, you see there's a lot of options. You can organize and keep your notes online but you can also export them to, <laughs> you guessed it, Evernote. So let's take a look. After installing it, you see these new icons on all your videos. You can highlight, annotate, and even clip parts of that video. So, so let's try it. I'm gonna play this one here. If I click here now, I get the timestamp. I can take a note, note one. It's simple as that. Click and take your note. Click and take your note. Say I'm done, I'm gonna click save. But if all I wanna do is create a highlight, I can click here, highlight, so I can jump to that point. Okay, like I mentioned before, you have access to all your notes, clicking here. The snippets are here. The videos I annotate on are here. But what I wanna do is export it to Evernote. So let's click here, export to Evernote and upgrade to a paid account. By the way, they are not a sponsor and paying for this upgrade, but I'm definitely open to proposals from companies that want to sponsor this channel. So let's upgrade the account. Oh, in fact, it says here that I will only be charged after 15 days. So no risk, you can also try it. Okay, let's go back to the video. Now let's export it to Evernote. Okay, it's not really export. You have to connect your Evernote account to it. Let's go to Evernote. Okay, this looks like it is an image. Yes, it is. It could be a, it could be the embedded video would be better. And below this, Okay, I had to stop for a while and check Evernote permission screen because I'm doing this on the fly. I thought it was a good idea to share with you my to share the experience while I was trying the service and the permission allowed them to update notes and I decided to try something here. Let me show you. On the left screen of the note I have Evernote, the note in Evernote that I have already exported and on the right screen I have YouTube. What happens here is when I add, let's say a highlight here, this is 349, pay attention on the left side of the screen and you see that it will update the note. Okay, any moment now. <laughs> there it is. Hi, future me here editing the video. Like I already said, this format is an experiment. I wanted to capture my real time reactions, but I end up missing a detail that I have to show you. Although the option in the menu says export to Evernote, you can see here in the connection page, it says sync. And there's also a checkbox to enable and disable the auto sync. This is really good. Another point is that if you paid attention to the menu, you notice that there are other export options. I encourage you to try them. I did try them, but decide to leave them out of the video because this is about exporting to Evernote. Back to the video now. Okay, let's try, let's try a snapshot. Okay, here it is, another one. Okay, let me save this. Will this be updated? Oh, yes, here it is. Pretty cool. This real-time connection is quite neat, but it looks like it's not updated to take full advantage of the new features of Evernote 10. I hope they do update it. But there's always the traditional way of doing it. If you want to explore other options to annotate your videos, watch this other video. If this was useful for you, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. See you soon.